what is up everyone this is Georgia the Techie back again with more Chromebook tips. Time is of the essence when you are trying to be productive and one of the easiest ways to save time while working on your Chromebook is to use keyboard shortcuts. Here are my favorites. When you have apps pinned note the number in sequential order on the shelf. You can quickly launch these apps by holding down the search or launcher key followed by the number corresponding to that app. Take a screenshot of your full screen by holding down control followed by the show windows key. Alternatively, you can take a screenshot of a portion of your screen by holding down the control and shift keys followed by the show windows key, then click and drag until your desired section is selected. By the, by the fact that Chromebooks don't have a caps lock key, you can turn on caps lock by holding down the search or launcher key, followed by the alt key, then turn it back off by pressing the same keys again. You can dock a window on either side of your display by pressing alt, followed by the left or right square bracket, and thus using a split screen. If your Chromebook is connected to a monitor, you can move a window from one screen to the other by holding down the launcher key, followed by Alt and M. You can zoom in and out by holding down Control, followed by the plus sign to increase the zoom or the minus sign to decrease it. Cycle through your open tabs by pressing Ctrl plus Tab. This is especially handy if you are using an external keyboard and a mouse rather than your Chromebook's built-in touchpad. <laughs> Similarly, you can also cycle through open windows by pressing Alt plus Tab. This one is the holy grail of multitasking on pretty much any operating system. Create a new virtual desk by pressing the launcher key plus shift, followed by the equal sign. Then press the launcher key again, followed by the left or right square bracket to cycle through your separate desk. And finally, when you need a cheat sheet to remember all of these shortcuts and more, you can press Ctrl plus Alt and the forward slash to get a handy searchable list. If you like this quick tutorial and would like to see more like this, give this video a like. Also, please subscribe to the channel and click on that bell to get notified the next time I post a video. See you in the next one.